All right, my man, state your name and let them know you're on Nickavelli TV. Yo, my name is Ron from Brooklyn. I'm on Nickavelli TV right now. That's what's up. Nick fan? Nick's fan, Nick's fan. I've been a Nick's fan for the longest, but I think my man Patrick Muir, he kind of he kind of cursed the Knicks with that, that lazy-ass layup, but, but the Knicks will come through sooner or later. Oh, man, we over that, though, man. That, 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 I mean, it, it hurt it, but the curse been released, man. I think it's with Chris Pazingas now because he can't catch a break right now. That's true, that's true, but you got to also think about it. Talk we, to we, we, That's the closest we got to winning a ring when when you and did that layup. That's the closest we got to winning a ring. Now we get we get great players, and we just it's just something – just not pushing us, you know what I mean? Just not pushing the Knicks right. They're not making it to the playoff like they're supposed to, you know what I mean? Okay. But, not, but, but how you feel about the new game, man? How you feel about the Fizz kids, man? I'm loving the new squad. I'm loving the new squad. They turn over new leaf and whatnot, so I'm back to the blue and orange again and whatnot because of the new squad. All I'm going to do is just wait until the season fall out, man. All right, you know now, I mean? do you know about these players that's currently playing, like Mitchell Robinson, Kevin Knox, Frank Nilakina? No. You don't know about none of these players? No, no, no. Oh, damn. Wait, wait now. Wait, wait. So we can't talk about today's Knicks because you've been off the radar. Exactly. 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 I can't talk about today's Knicks because I fell off because even when they got Spreewell, for Spreewell, so let's talk. Like, take me back, man, because that's where Spreewell, you were. Spreewell, I left when I left when they got rid of Spreewell. So who was and your... And they got Carmelo, and then I had to break it. And they let Carmelo go because... You know, but the last thing I had to let it go. I let the Knicks go for a little while, but I'm always going to be a New York fan. So talk to me about why you think the Knicks didn't get a ring during the Patrick Ewing. I know you expressed the finger roll. I mean, we had the, we had the, we had the, that's when they were the New York Knickerbockers. Right. I mean, they played hard. They put, they put um, the ball in the basket multiple times. And when, you know what I mean? They, to me, that was the best squad ever. When they had Starks, all them other cats and whatnot. Was you a fan of Starks? Yeah, yes, I was. Um, Oakley, um, all, all. The gorillas, they was the gorillas then, man. You know what I mean? Wow. So you you like that tough bad I like the boy. Tough, y'all like the bad boy knickerbockers when they had the, the paces in, in Chicago under pressure. You know what I mean? These these knickerbockers, these New York Knicks we got now, soft boys, man. We need some hard players. Niggas that don't want to come under the hole. You know what I mean? They had Oakley in you know, them, Charles, they they ain't letting nobody come under the hole. Remember Xavier remember, remember Xavier McDaniels? Yes. How you had Pippin's heart, man? We had, we had, Jordan, Jordan and Reggie Miller was our killer. If they could have just shut them two down, the Knicks would have had multiple rings. Multiple rings. It wasn't for Miller and then um, um, Michael Jordan. We, we, we shut um, Reggie Miller down. We, we shut Miller down. Miller always killed us at the last minute. The I last mean, minute. I, knew, I knew it was a, a serious way he scored. Where he, I know he did the choke sound to Spike Lee. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Right. We, yeah, right. yeah, but... Concerning Jordan, I, I can't deny that. He definitely stopped a lot of people from getting rings. And what hurt it is that when he left for two years to play baseball, I thought maybe you'd be able to squeeze in some titles there. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. I thought the same way. I thought once once Jordan left, knowing he ain't going to do good in no damn baseball, I thought the Knicks was like, we're going to dominate the sport. I don't just know what happened. I don't know. It's just, it's just me and my soul think once um, Ewan did that finger roll and missed it, that was it. He was there, dunked it. He was there, showed them we here. Bang. He was there, banged it on them. Once he did banged it on them, we done won the title. But ever since that, we done So you close. saying it's it's the finger roll that was the that cause cursed of... That the Knicks. That cursed the Knicks. That's what I think, yo. And you don't think that the curse is released, being that... No, because we get good, we get good players. The Knicks get good players. But I don't know. Is it just... Brother, was, guess, you, was you in tune with the draft? No, sir. It wasn't? No, sir. So you don't even know we got the third pick? All I'm going to do is sit back and watch the season and see how we do. I don't know. I ain't supposed to draft. No, I didn't. You ain't repping no other team, right? No, sir. So you just a Nick fan on standby. That's right. I'm standby on the cut. Like, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my man. It is what it is. I want to thank you for coming on Nickavelli TV. And before we go, real quick, are you a fan of Carmelo Anthony possibly coming back? I would like for him to come back. But he, he would definitely need help. He won't be the star. He definitely going to – he'd be a good factor to the team. But Carmelo, he might be done. He might be done. And all this hype about KD and Kyrie coming to the Knicks? I would love that. Who you would anticipate more? Come. Kyrie. Why Kyrie? I don't know. I just like the way he play. I like his, I like his style of ball playing. Think Why he's not? the best point guard in the NBA? No, I don't think he's the best. 
I don't think he's the best. Wow. Top three? He's good. He's good. He's good. He's good. Top Put three? Top three? Yeah, give or take. I, yeah, I'll put him in top three. But if he comes to the Knicks, we can use all the help we can get. Man. All right, man. That's what it is, man. Now we out. I want to thank y'all once again for tuning in to Nickavelli TV. Nickavelli. Peace.